Hey everyone, I'm Steve Toth of seonotebook.com. That's where I share my weekly strategy tips by email every Tuesday. I don't hold anything back, so you're pretty much getting my best knowledge. All right, so if you like this, please do subscribe if you haven't already. So today's note is going to be about two things, extracting entities from a Wikipedia page and a spreadsheet to help that out, and a free tool that I developed to help you add entities to any Google Doc. All right, so let's get into that first part. Let's, let's extract the entities. So here I'm on Fender, uh, Wiki, Fender's Wikipedia page. You can see I have some Fenders behind me. I'm a big fan. And I go over to the Google Natural Language API page where they have this demo. And I pasted the contents from the Wikipedia article into this section. And then the output is something like this, where you see all these different entities um, inside these brackets. Now, getting going through this manually and extracting these entities is going to be a huge pain in the butt. So I've created a spreadsheet to help you do that basically in one click. So now I'm just going to copy that and I'm going to go over to my entities spreadsheet and I'm just going to click the cell and then paste it in. So now you're going to see here that all the entities have uh, generated below that. Um, I might do some additional things like obviously copy this and then paste in place so that I can edit this, but I also may use this other extension called change case to make these all lowercase, but that's just me. Um, beyond that, you're gonna have to go through these entities and kind of select ones that you think are going to be relevant. Not all of those entities, they're in the thousands from that page are going to be relevant. So I just suggest you take a few minutes to go over each one and then pick out some relevant entities. So in this case, I've taken Fender, Instruments, California, Fullerton, Manufacturer, Jaguar, Precision Base, etc. Um, all things that are very relevant to the company Fender. So now that I have um, these entities, I'm going to select them and I'm going to go over to the tool. So again, this tool, I will show you how to extract entities from Wikipedia, and then using this tool, uh, we can add them to the content. So I'm just going to delete this because be, I'll show you what that does in a sec. And I'm going to paste the entities in here, and now you're going to see it start to count and notice how many times these words appear in the content. So Fender appears eight times, California appears five times, Designs appears three times, etc. So what I can also do, um, you know, as you're typing, these things are all going to light up green. And what I can also do is just click on these words to add them to the content, which is super cool, a little functionality that I wanted to put in there. So basically, you know, that's the note. Uh, we're going to go to Wikipedia, extract the entities, go to um, uh, using Google natural language pro uh, processor, and then um, use this spreadsheet to basically clean them up and, uh, and get rid of them. One thing I also didn't mention was removing duplicates from that. So you can just go up to data and then clean up data and remove duplicates here. Um, so once you have that, just go and uh, select the entities that you want, then use the tool to add those to your content. You know, this is pretty much what bigger tools um, do. They don't um, get entities in the exact same way. So it's not going to be 100% the same. But if you're working on a budget, or if you have other use cases, which I will share in subsequent notes, um, you can definitely use this tool to uh, enhance your content and basically make sure your writers are doing what they say that they're doing. Or here's a little teaser, is ChatGPT doing what it says it's doing? All right, well, that's pretty much it for today. Um, if you go to seonotebook.com, you can subscribe. Um, it's totally free. You get things like that um, in your inbox every Tuesday. Um, and then this week you're getting this entity extraction spreadsheet and um, the free tool, uh, which is called the SEO Notebooks Google Docs add-on. All right, so that's it. I'm Steve Toth. Thanks so much for watching and hope to see you next week. Take care. Thanks. Bye.